room for improvement perhaps, but despite their fragmented start to the season, it has largely been overlooked that Aberdeen remained in touching distance of a top six place, blinded of course by the comparison with the last season. An early lead would have been more than welcome against a United side that returned to form with a 3-1 win over Falkirk at the weekend, and if David Fernandez had shot past rather than at Ryan Essen, United's confidence might have seen them through a potentially tricky night. The chance came as injury reduced Aberdeen to nine men at the time. Back with 11, they carved out an excellent chance for Jamie Smith. He knew himself just how good it was. Yet Smith was to prove the old patient's virtue association holds true. Darren Mackey slipped his man at the corner flag before finding Smith, and then it was a case of good things don't just come to those who wait, but also to those who dribble past two defenders before shooting. Jimmy Calderwood fell short of calling for a Scotland call-up for his man, but I'm sure Walter Smith will be aware of his namesake at a time when he could do with this kind of composure in front of goal. The Aberdeen man might have to produce more of it first before he moves to the Scotland squad, but he was a key man for Aberdeen involved in starting this move. It led to the ball falling for Stevie Crawford, who chipped neatly over the fallen Derek Stilly to reply to all the criticism that came his way during his ill-fated time at Tanadice. Goals are never quite so sweet as when they come against your former employers. Even if you don't have a point to prove, there's great pleasure in proving it anyway. Aberdeen proving on the night they are back in form and not even the best efforts of Colin Samuel could change that. His raking drive, well held by Ryan Essen. Some long-awaited relief for home supporters who hadn't seen their side win here since August the 27th. Even if United's battling qualities and the pace of Samuel were to set up one last chance for United, Aberdeen take the points. And more pressure on Chiz.